What's up, guys? Welcome to the TMG podcast. This is actually last week's episode. You know what? Psych. Uh, you thought this was the same intro, but it's not. I have an announcement. We now have merch. That's right. And it's sick. It's absolutely cool as hell. So if you want some, um, if you want to support the show, go to fanjoy.co slash TMG. Fanjoy.co slash TMG. We appreciate you. Go check it out and uh, enjoy the episode. Got that tiny meat energy. Tiny meat energy. Small dick energy, people. It's all about the small peen. Small peen. Energy. Walk around like you got a small dick. A small hanger. Now this. Small hanger. Now at this point in time, this is relevant, but but, 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 but by the time you hear this episode. It might not be. It might not be. Now, because this will be out now about two two weeks weeks from from right now. now. Mm -hmm. So you know what they say. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a little stale. (laughs) I get creeped out when you talk in that voice. <laughs> Why? Matthew McConaughey voice. <laughs> yeah. Everything you say just sounds like it should be sexual. <laughs> yeah. You get a little stale. Little I'm like, stale. Oh, ew, what's stale? I don't want to think of that. Here's what's what, stale? Man, here's what you do. You take two of these, slide them right on down the uh, salami hat. Now <laughs> should that tip forward. <laughs> Now you're in for a little ride. <gasps> Ooh, this, is, this is what's good about bulk recording is that you got... We, callbacks we, on callbacks. Callbacks on callbacks because yeah. to us it just happened. Yeah. To you, this shit's week old. Yeah. And you're probably like, oh, the oh, salami yeah. hat shit. That was pure gold. Yeah. We should we should have a soundboard, you know. We should have like the Quake sound sound effects every time we hit a callback. That's dope. Yeah. Like a big one. Annihilating. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Triple. You know what Fortnite... Dude. No. Nope. Are we going to go there again? No. Nope. No. Nope. Can I just say it real quick? What? You know what Fortnite needs? What? Kill combos. Triple kill, quad kill, whatever. Yeah, that does hype you up a little Fucking bit. Fucking so hype when that yeah. shit happens. Yeah. Triple kill. Yeah. And Call of Duty, when you get kill streaks and you yeah. get like rewards, fucking, there's no better feeling than getting an airstrike because yeah. you got an eight kill streak or whatever. Yeah. God damn. <laughs> well, then they need to put that at kill one. Like if someone gets one kill. <laughs> no, no. Annihilating. Oh, hell yeah, dude. I really don't like the Battle Royale game mode, I realize. Or the, the gameplay. Oh, I don't the like shooting? It. It's, yeah. way, it's way worse than Call of Duty and no, it's Capture garbage. the Flag and shit like it's that. It's garbage. It really does suck. I don't know why it's so popular. Because it's more addicting. The building makes it fun. No, I'm saying like the game. Like why is the, that game format so popular right now? Because oh. there's games where you don't build that are the same thing. Yeah, I don't know. It's interesting. Oh, anyway. Because wins are more rare and it's more rewarding when you get one, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. Probably. Anyways. Skins. Big dick energy. Yeah, yeah. There's it's a big, that's a phrase that's, that's yeah, very relevant right now. A big dick energy. Um, so Helen Donahue uh, has written this article. Uh, she wrote it on June 27th, which is two about two weeks ago. Okay. Yeah. Well, uh, how's your 4th of July? <laughs> it was great, dude. Yeah? Yeah, it was great. Awesome. Actually, yeah. no, you'll be having, uh, this will be like one week. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, so how is it going? Because technically it'll it will have just happened. Oh yeah, right? no, I'm, gonna, I'm well. Right now I'm gonna fly back. Yeah. Uh, so because right now is the fifth, right? Or no, now yeah. it's, now it's the fourth. No, now it's the fifth because the fourth the is on a Thursday. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'm heading back. So nice, dude. Yeah, yeah. Was it, it, was, was it good? Yeah, it was good, dude. Yeah? It was good. It was good. Just you got drunk, stay huh? sober. No. No. Huh? No, sober. Sober. Yeah, just hung out and cool. Hung out in the sun. Make sure you got a lot of water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Drank a lot of water. Hydrated. Mm-hmm. Feeling good today. Good. Real good. Good. And uh, yeah, heading back productive day and yeah it's good nice dude. yeah very nice yeah thanks for checking yeah so we could go helen wrote this article about big dick energy okay okay and um she's kind of <clears throat> i think you know part of her point here is that uh you know this is this is an emasculating thing and the article is on playboy isn't it's on it? playboy yeah playboy.com yeah and uh in playboy.gov to, to quote big dicks fucking suck there's nothing fun about getting your cervix rammed until it goes numb. And by the way, 10 inches is not big. It's the length of my forearm. Thanks for the ad. Appreciate that ad. So she's saying 10 inches. Yeah, she said that's enormous. Unusual even. Sounds like compliments to me. Yeah. Sounds yeah, like a lot of sounds compliments. Like, that sounds like a lot of compliments. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's not just, that's not big. That's colossally <laughs> huge. Adam is somewhere right now. Like, keep going. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> you, you said that's what? It's gargantuan. Yeah, 
Comparable to a monster. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a bit of a beast in the bed, you know. <laughs> uh, but of a beast in the bed. I'm a bit of a beast in the bed. No, his accent is weird. I can't do the mm-hmm. way. Because he talks with that weird, like, like mm-hmm. it's like, he's like talking with the mic. Yeah. 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 Um, if my vagina couldn't take a lenient fisting, parentheses, it can't, it's going to find the concept of a 10 inch dick frankly disturbing. I'm not going to fake that I in any way dig getting pulverized by this. <laughs> By dick, it sounds like a fanfic. Yeah, by dick the size of wooden truncheon. These are very wooden truncheons this, that British cops carried around until the late nineties. This I, honestly sounds like a fanfic. It's like yeah. weird comparisons that are just way too forced. I'm I'm getting horny right now. Yeah. <laughs> I I would never love the thought take of getting this gargantuan cock pole vault down my. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's not cock. Yeah, yeah. make my cervix numb. Yeah. Oh, this colossal skyscraper <laughs> serpent of a body part excavating my interior. Man, it's what? Like, what are you writing? An article? You, There's no one. This is yeah. on Playboy.com. Oh, here we go. We know the average erect dick is a smidge over. What's a smidge? A couple inches. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We know the average dick is just a smidge over five inches. You never heard of a smidge? Yeah, a smidge that's actually is a scientific inches. unit. Is it? Yeah, yeah three smidge. inches. It's part of the metric system. It's yeah. roughly equivalent to three inches. Got it. Yeah, that's one smidge. Yeah. Oh, got it. Yeah. It was nice if it was just a so smidge So my dick is half, half a smidge. Yeah, nice. <laughs> nice, dude. Half a smidge. <laughs> so what are you working with down there? I'm about a smidge. Nice. <laughs> smidge. Oh, very nice. Oh, my God. Um. So why are people one? Prote- a, wait, sorry. A smidge is a unit of dick. <laughs> <laughs> U O D. That's what it is. A smidge. A smidge is a unit of dick. That's how you measure dicks in smidges. That was three smidges. Three smidges. Yeah. 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 What are they? What are the equivalent? I know we just equivalized. Equivalized it. Equivalized it. I know yeah. we just. Uh, what is the word? What is the present tense of that? Um, equated. I know we just equated them to to three about roughly three inches, but it's actually you can't really compare. You can't really compare now. Because you're technically, you're not supposed to measure dicks in inches. Yeah. You're supposed to measure them in smidges. Yeah, because smidges. smidges encompasses girth and length in one unit of dick. So one smidge. <laughs> he's about nine smidges. Yeah, he's about oh. nine smidges. Not bad, not bad. Nine smidges. Anyways. Oh, nine? That's kind of like 14 smidges to me. Mm. It's like five smidges to me. Yeah, it's like waves. You have to measure them. Yeah. A five-foot wave isn't a five-foot wave elsewhere. For right. some reason, it just measures differently depending on the break. Awesome, that's what it is. It's Got depending it. on the girl, depending on the dick. Got it. It's depending on your your definition of smidge. Yeah, you know what I mean. We'll so four smidges out. to one girl could be different to for to another girl. That's why this girl yeah. ten smidges is a little bit too much. Whereas I, for another girl who I, likes getting the cervix rammed, ten smidges is sizable. Yeah, and, I believe and, and, I believe I'm the baseline smidge. Yeah, of disappointment. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm just enough. Just an, just enough smidges to almost satisfy. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm the baseline for oh, it's not bad. <laughs> yeah, it's not bad. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's like it's definitely sex. Yeah, yeah. We we. I mean, you you had sex. You for sure had sex. All right. So she goes on. Um, why are people one pretending they've ever seen a massive penis like in the wild? Well, I've watched porn. Two. That's not in the wild. I guess, yeah. Two. Unless acting you've seen like, one in real life. <laughs> acting like Pete Davidson is suddenly the model example of shafts. Shafts? Shafts. My minimal amount of research tells me only 2% of men have dicks bigger than 8 inches. 2% really? Wow. Wow. Wait, by her research, she yeah. said? Yeah. Just by how many dudes she's fucked? I don't know what that means. Or How do you do research on dick size? Who has gigantic dicks? Then you just ask Google. Yeah. Yeah. So unless you're me and you've fucked enough people to populate a remote medieval village. Oh, I, there you go. I don't believe you've seen a 10-inch stick, and my encounters still to this very day make me shudder. Whoa, that was loaded. There was a lot packed in there. It's crazy. Is that guilt? Fuck. Now, why do I feel sad? But you can't, I mean, you can't refute what she's saying. She's saying she's fucked enough people that, and she, obviously she has no trouble attracting men if she's fucked that many. Yeah. And she has never come across, or very few times, a 10-inch dick. Got it. It's And so people say big dick energy, whatever. She's like, no, it's not real. And so, it's, it's bad energy. So I have, I mean, 
That just nulls Tiny Meat Gang then, does it? What do you mean? No, there's tons of dudes with small dicks. This one, but I'm saying like... <laughs> there's more We're, to, we're the majority. <laughs> we're the majority. Yeah. It, it was supposed to... We're coming, no, you know, this doesn't null us. This empowers us. Yeah. Because we're coming from a place of inferiority. Yeah. Now, you know what? Get your fucking big dick asses out of here, all right? You fucking <laughs> corny ass big dick having that. What the fuck? You got a big dick? Get out of here, bro. I'm about... I'm about Little smidge energy. Yeah, yeah. We're taking it back to like Greek shit, uh-huh. Roman shit. Yeah. You got a big dick in public. You dumb as fuck. Yes. We're gonna yeah. clown I'm you, homie. Right on top of the balls. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Because you know Pubes why? Out and everything. Because you know I'm small. Mm-hmm. I mean I'm smart. I mean I'm I'm smart. Couple smidge energy. Yeah. Yeah. I got smidge energy. Triple I'm smart. Smidge, triple smidge energy. I'm That's... triple smidge smart out here, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? What else you got saying? Um. We all know we don't like bleeding during what during what? or after sex. Suffering abrasions so bad, our vagina hurts for a week, and sitting feels awkward, itchy, crying out in pain. Abrasions? Jesus from Christ! From sex? What? When gnarly that side- happens? Damn! I'm not having sex like that. Dude, people are going hard. Uh, this next paragraph is like read it. <laughs> Let's hear this shiz. Uh, yeah, when gnar- when a gnarly sized dick nails our cervix at the wrong angle, not being able to produce enough moisture naturally, or physically throwing up on a dick. Son, what? We also hate faking. Or like, you've done this to someone? Damn. What's what is it? What does it say after about faking <laughs> orgasms? Faking it is uh, is is not good. It's uncomfortable when sex is satisfying. It's typically comfortable. And all this. Where did that. you even find this? Uh, Twitter. Huh. Um, it's weird. You don't really come across weird shit on Twitter very often. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> like the video that those kids fighting that you sent yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those Spock. Yeah. Those two gay <laughs> that dudes. That shit was crazy. Those two gay dudes molly whopping each other. They were like, they went in. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, when gay when gay dudes fight. Oh, yeah. nah. No, nah, because they got a woman's passion behind a, a man's biceps, mm-hmm. and it's just. No, no, you know what it is? It's a woman's passion sitting on testosterone. Mm-hmm. It's lights out, bro. Yeah. They'll claw your shit out. They'll bite it out. Mm-hmm. Anything. Well, they were like, they were like punching each other, too. They were oh, like punching going. the shit out of each yeah. other. Look up, look up, like, you, you want to talk about uh, the most brutal fight videos are always gay dudes, drunk gay dudes. At some like Waffle House. Really? Yeah. Bitch, don't talk about. Here it goes. <laughs> Here it goes. And they just boom. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I, I think <laughs> when guys fight, it's like this like straight guys, it's like this like, yeah, like man to man, we're going to clot out. Gay dudes, street fights, it's always like, now I'm throwing you across the restaurant. <laughs> I'm going to pour salt in your fucking eyes. I'm going to beat your ass in front of your boyfriend. I'm going <laughs> to whoop his ass. <laughs> And if you act wild, my fucking friends are going to jump in and strangle you with fucking glitter and yeah. shit. <laughs> strangle you with glitter? Somehow. Just make, fill your mouth with yeah, it? Yeah, just yeah, <laughs> suffocate them with glitter. <laughs> Quit talking that shit, bro. Take more glitter. <coughs> make him a glitter pinata hang up in front of his house. And say, this is what happens when you talk shit about us, bro. Turn you into a glitter pinata. Yeah. Should we keep reading this article? No. It's getting dis- disturbing. Yeah, it's making me feel bad too. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Man, I'm fucking. Uh. <sighs> that big dick energy tired you out, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's really not about triple smidge energy. It's not triple smidge. No, I got no energy right now. Yeah, nothing. You got that low T. Nothing. In the need tank. you. Need you a little bit of t- just a quick steroid. I would love a little testosterone right <laughs> just now. A quick steroid. Just a li- little quick quick injection. <laughs> You know, just a real quick six hundred bars. You know how much, you know how much pro steroid content is on YouTube. Really, there's a lot of it. Yeah, people just being like, "Yeah, you should juice." Yeah, like ju- like juice built like bodybuilders, and they're like, "Yeah, I'm on it, and I take this much, and this is the way to do it," and they all look like they're gonna explode. <laughs> but it's just funny to think about skin's way too tight. Yeah, <laughs> it's just funny to think about like, oh, we police like. Like YouTube will police certain content, but like that content is readily available. I know. And do, they do nothing to stop that. I know. It's just funny. Like a 14 year old kid, dude, uh, a buddy of mine told me recently some guys we knew, in, or th- I wasn't really acquainted with them, 
but there were some guys we knew in high school who were taking a supplement and it had had roids in it. It's banned now, and I forget what the what the supplement is. And it was legal, like you could buy it. At it was GNC. legal for a period. Yeah, huh. it was like on the shelf, and then it, and then people like it was tested and figured out that steroids in it, so it's banned. You can still buy it like in Europe or like on online somewhere. Um, but I remember these two kids; they were fucking huge. <laughs> really, we were like sixteen, but they looked like they were like twenty five, like NFL players. They were, one of them was like a little dude like me, and he was jacked. I'm like, how the we looked the same, and then, like, three months later, he's fucking curling, like, 80s. Damn. We're like, what the fuck? And then found out later. Roids. They are on the fucking gear, but I they didn't know they it. what they look like now. Well, weird. Just, like... A little wilted. Yeah. You think so? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just imagining, like, accidentally taking roids in high school. <laughs> that's got to fuck your shit up, dude. That's like, when you're going through you puberty. Up. Yeah. Like... That's got to fuck you up. Yeah. yeah. Fucks up your testosterone... Huge inhibitors. It's gotta the fuck. fuck that shit up. Yeah, brutal. Also, on the gear at sixteen, bro, you probably want to fuck everything. Yeah, <laughs> but your <laughs> sex drive is just through the fucking roof. Just look outside. You're like fucking a fire hydrant. He's like, what? What? You got some news over there? <laughs> what? No, nothing. Yeah, there's nothing at all. Nothing. Yeah, nothing. Nothing to see there. Yeah, <laughs> see there. That was a group thread. Yeah, you know. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Between dudes just yeah. sending send each other. I love when girls I love when girls find out that dudes send each other hot pictures or <laughs> pictures of hot girls. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So yeah. as a girl finds that shit out, they're like, Wait, you you just send each other hot pictures all day on Instagram? <laughs> We're like, Yeah. <laughs> sorry, every guy does that. I'm sorry. They do. And well, now you know. Rip. R. I. P. bro. Mm-hmm. Um fuck is say? Oh yeah. Oh well, no. Matt, that wasn't that wasn't in reference to Kelsey, by the way. That was like every girl that has ever yeah, found uh, that out. Yeah, I'm sure. By like seeing my phone or something, he's like, yeah. hey, "What is that? I, Do you my, guys just send each other hot pictures of girls all day?" One of my home. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Why? I have no idea. I don't know. <laughs> One of my homies. We just he, do it. He used to just like openly, like on his lunch break, just like browse like Jinx profiles and just like liked her pictures. I'm like, I'm like, your what? Like your wife is cool with that? And he just looks up. He's like, I'm not going anywhere. Bro. <laughs> like, I'm not going anywhere. I pay the rent. I pay for our cars. <laughs> I could do this shit all I want. Oh, I I'm see. I'm not going oh, I anywhere. See. I see. I see. I see. I see. <laughs> I see. Just, <laughs> he just kept doing that. I was like, well, fair, I guess. Yeah, but happy wife, happy life. life. Am I right? Am I right, gentlemen? I'm sure she's following man candy account. Yo, that that Probably. phrase, man candy, is so funny to me. <laughs> Why? I don't know. There's something very juvenile about it. <laughs> just <laughs> Man candy. <laughs> Arm candy. It just using candy to describe a person is like weirdly demeaning. I don't know why man candy is so funny to me. Yeah. <laughs> Being referred to as man candy, I think is a diss a little Mandy. bit. Yeah. Well, I, look I, at, I don't think it's a diss. You don't think so? I don't think so. No? I look at you a bit of man candy over there. <laughs> it's like, yeah, people like the look. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I've never been referred to as man candy ever. Yeah. No, I mean, I don't think so. I tweeted a while ago. Snack is a little bit better. (laughs) (laughs) Snack is like a smidge of man candy. Yeah, exactly. It's just just a smidge of man candy. (laughs) Looking like a snack with two C's. The more C's, the the more smidge. Yeah. (laughs) I said, I tweeted one time. Snack is a unit of man candy. (laughs) He's about two snacks. (laughs) He's about two snacks. Five smidges, two snacks. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> looking like two snacks looking like two snacks looking like diet man candy I tweeted once that I'm going to tr- turn my account into a man candy account of me <laughs> <laughs> like it's just going to be me posing with cowboy hats and shit on like radiators and cars <laughs> just just not man candy at all like a calendar from the early 2000s <laughs> yeah. like fixing cars yeah, just fucking- sweaty in a <laughs> Showing up, the cable guy. Yes. You wearing like a, like just no shirt. You're a firefighter. <laughs> yeah, firefighter. Firefighter bait with no shirt underneath the thing. <laughs> Putting out a fire, butt ass naked, <laughs> just with the hat and a fucking jock strap on. <laughs> uh, I think the new shit is calling attractive people diabetes. You know. 
Oh yeah, yeah. Because you eat too many snacks, you get diabetes. Yeah, yeah. You're looking like a full uh, oh. snack. You're looking like diabetes. Babe, you're looking like type two right now. <laughs> Swear to God. Oh man. Took my insulin shot. Oh my God. <laughs> 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 In the club, pulling that shit out. <laughs> oh, baby, hold up, hold up. What are you doing? I'm pulling up my insulin. Why? Because you diabetes, straight up. <laughs> you looking like 25,000 snacks, right? You looking like a lifetime snack supply, baby. Did I win a contest uh, or something? Like from... years and years of chocolate cake. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you look like. <laughs> Did I win like a, like a Hershey's contest, baby? Because... <laughs> I feel like I got a snack for life with you. <laughs> Damn. Big ass chocolate bunny. <laughs> feel free to use that yeah. if you want to use that. That's Hey Ma, you diabetes? Cause you looking like a whole lot of snacks. <laughs> Get the fuck out of my booth. <laughs> Let me just check my blood sugar real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh man, I'm still I'm still juggling a shitty man candy calendar. <laughs> <laughs> you print that out for your girl. She's like, we got to do a tiny meat gang. One of those. Yeah, but it's just, it's bad. Yeah. It's super bad. <laughs> just not attractive at all. Yeah. Just awful bodies. Farmer's and, tan and shit. Farmer's <laughs> tan, fire in a fucking firefighter suit. Yeah. And, and you know what I'm saying? Like, it's not like, like being uh, out of shape. Cause if you're, if you're the extreme, like one way or the other, it's like, if you're super out of shape, it's like you're owning it. And it's funny when you're just average looking, like you have like one ab. Mm-hmm. I feel like that's what makes it funny. Yeah, it's like people are like, well, you're trying, you're trying, but shape. it's not working. Yeah, <laughs> doing something wrong. <laughs> and then like, let's do this. The calendar, like as it progresses through the year, the careers get weirder and weirder. Like it's just <laughs> now we're like an IT guy. We're standing fully <laughs> business shirt and slacks, like no skin, yeah, no skin. at all. And then, like, next one, we're, like, a zoologist or some shit <laughs> posing beside, like... Working on a doctorate. <laughs> yeah. A scientist. Yeah, a scientist. Yeah, they, one of them is just homeless. Yeah, dude. A hot homeless dude. The last dude. one, December, <laughs> yeah. is homeless. Whoa, what? Hot homeless dude, bro. A sexy homeless dude? That's just everyone in Venice, though. Yeah, that's true. That's actually. every dude in Venice. That's true, actually. Yeah. That's that one guy with the bird scooters. Yeah. He's a sexy homeless dude. Yeah, yeah. I, like, I, I get why those guys... <laughs> get by on life mm-hmm. oh man you know, i'm just fucking hot i'm fucking this like like oh, this my. like cougar bitch yeah, like, i'll like live with her technically but like, like whatever whatever she's like invested in like, disney or some shit we're not dating but it's like whatever like i still go out with other girls <laughs> you talk to her no my boyfriend you know he's a little <laughs> transient <laughs> you know he's just he's a free spirit yeah you know, I'm trying to. I do. I do house him technically. He doesn't actually have a, a place of his own. But he'll be paying rent soon. Yeah. You know, just trying he's to find get, something. Yeah, he's got to get back on his feet. I'm <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, this girl I live with, whatever. whatever. It's fucking. <laughs> fucking. I, I just go there and I can't like fuck someone else, <laughs> you know. So someone, a girl listening to the podcast right now is with one of those dudes. Yeah. Sexy homeless guy. And she's got her shit together. Yeah. And he's knocking her boots off. Yeah. And she's just like, you know, well, he's a skateboarder. Yeah, he's in a band or something. Wait, hold up. He's not, okay, don't, you're inching towards rapper. We need to back away from that because no. now we're starting to describe us. No, 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 no. I'm just, I'm not a rapper. Yeah, we're not rappers. Yeah. Yeah, we're comedians. Yeah, yeah. Come- yeah. Re- re- no. <laughs> I'm just trying to combine the two words, but. Oh, yeah, no, no. It doesn't work. Yeah, no, no, no. Um, a, a sexy man candy. <laughs> You're talking about man candy for the last like ten minutes. <laughs> it's been no, but that's that's what it feels. It feels like ten minutes. It's been twenty seconds. Yeah, it's been absolutely been twenty, 20 seconds. seconds since we started talking about man candy. <laughs> I want to know comment comment if you um follow a man candy account. Yeah, or like a lady lady boner. Yeah, that's lady, a good yeah, one too. That's yeah. a good phrase. Lady that's boner. That's a great phrase. I've never been a lady boner. I think someone posted me on the lady boner subreddit <laughs> one time. And you probably got what'd you get? What do you think? What did I get? Yeah, two upvotes. What do you think you no, got? No, I was like on the front page, I think. Get the fuck out. I mean, out. it was a picture where I looked good. <laughs> I don't normally you know, it was an odd picture. Like one of those one of the I don't know. I think it was the one actually where like I'm black and white. Oh, okay. Look like it died. You okay. know? Yeah. So maybe it was like a remorse sort of thing. People were like, oh. oh he's dead. Wow, he's a hot dead guy. <laughs> <laughs> Being dead makes you so much hotter. 
look at Jeffrey Dahmer. There you go. Okay. Yeah. All them guys. Yeah. Or no, they, they were killers. Yeah. But Jeffrey Dahmer's not dead, is he? Is he's he in dead. jail? I think he's dead. Oh. Maybe. I don't know. There's that whole cult of women who, or young girls who think serial killers are hot or whatever. Yeah. Like the <clears throat> Columbine dudes. No. no. Yep. No. Yes. No. Yes. There is a community of girls that think those guys are hot and <laughs> like have a weird dude. I saw a fucking edit, like an edit, a oh, fan, like one of those a fan, fan edit. edit of the Columbine dudes from the footage from their like I home footage laugh. and shit. I can't laugh, dude. It's fucked. I saw that shit. I was like, what? It's that fucking. You so precious. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's spazzy. Oh, God. Fucking Russ in the background. <laughs> With fucking the Columbine kids. It That's was messed not up, Not good, bro. <laughs> That's so fucked yeah, up. It was fucked up. I'm like, I'm shocked. I'm shocked, yeah. man. <clears throat> oh, Jesus. I mean, I guess Dahmer's not. I feel like I'm further away from Jeffrey Dahmer. So, like, I say that name and it doesn't, like, bother me as much. But, God damn. Yeah. And actually, yeah, making a fan edit, that's super modern. Yeah. Don't do that. Yeah. It's <clears throat> fucked up. Yeah. Very fucked up. Speaking of looking like you died, uh, I'm so pissed I didn't save it. There was this thing that uh, I know Sam was asking for it. I saw it on Twitter. So iPhoto will make these collages of your pictures with music. Uh-huh. And these guys, like, they posted one of them. They went to a rave, and they're like, uh, iPhoto made this collage of us and it looks like we're dead. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I think I saw that. It's like this really <laughs> weirdly mellow music. Like it's not happy. It's like melancholy as fuck. <laughs> it's just them like posted up at like a rave, like in different ways. And, they and all sp- the pictures are black and white. No, no. It's just like, uh, it's just like, it's like the Ken Burns shit. Like it's like zoomed in, then zoomed out. And it's like fading into oh, pictures fuck. of them. Like, That's like so arms around each other. They totally look like they died in a car accident. It was like, holy fuck. Oh my God, dude. I want to find this shit. <laughs> I tried looking. It was so good. Oh, damn. God damn That's it. Really this shit funny. was so good. <laughs> I've been chuckling a lot today. Oh my god. Um. Oh yeah. This I'm just going through my notes because I've been so I've been trying to write like more premises because okay. anticipating our um. Can we talk about it? Yeah, sure. We can talk about it. We're we're like well no we're in the preliminary stages of organizing another tour. Yeah. At the beginning of the year, but it's gonna be all around the nation. Yeah, it'll so, be bigger. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be the whole the whole of the United States. Of yeah. America. The whole kit and caboodle. United States and America. The United States in America. Uh-huh. The United States in America. In America. Yeah. In and on America. Mm-hmm. Oh, you know what? <clears throat> well. What? What? <laughs> Dude. Big Dude. dick energy. <laughs> How about that, huh? <laughs> what do you say about that? So what's this premise? I see you got something written down right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, there's actually two things I want to go on about. Um, speaking of United States in America and cowboys and shit. Okay. It's, it's Westworld. Okay. Talk some shit about Westworld. I don't know. I don't watch that shit. You don't have to. Okay. You don't have to. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I was thinking, because oh, I saw. the way you yeah, yeah, there you go. go. Right there. Yeah. Oh, that's way better. Yeah, is it? Yeah. It's just sitting right on your chin there. Yeah, you can just like dope. put your face up. And yeah. Just, uh, and just kind of. <laughs> no, don't do that. No, don't do that. <laughs> I'm good on In case you're not All watching, the way good on that. Yeah. If you're listening on iTunes, Cody is um like kissing up to the mic like a pair of nuts well no well no i'm not kissing it like a pair of nuts i'm kissing it like tom brady (laughs) kissing it like it's my son yo wait i linked this shit in the chat this fool said okay tom brady confirms on ig that he likes eating ass (laughs) and it's got this funny ass picture of his face but yo look at this Brady hopped in the Barstool Sports IG comments to say when Giselle gets out of the shower, it's eating ass season. All right, this fool is a predator in his own house. Jesus Christ. Kissing his son. Yeah. Hunting Giselle's butt cheeks. It's ass eating season, baby. God. (laughs) Just waiting for it outside the bathroom for when she gets out of the shower like a (sighs) tiger. Just (laughs) He's calling Pouncing. Calling audibles when she gets out of the. Mm -hmm. Hot route. (laughs) Oh, my God. Oh my god! No, no, Tom, Tom, Tom. No, 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 no. We're taking the money road. <laughs> oh, <laughs> zinger! <sighs> mudslide, mudslide, <laughs> forty-two, mudslide. It. Hey. Um. <clears throat> all right. So I was. Someone was tweeting about a vibrator, whatever. And I was like, I was thinking to myself, sex toys are too. They're too nerdy now. Mm-hmm. 
like like they feel like vapes. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like there's too much like they're too accepted. Yeah, yeah. You know, they I, don't like feel, like sex toys. I feel like were a thing. You know, when I was younger, it's like it was like wrong, mm-hmm. or, like it was like risky. Now it's like it's too. I don't know. Yeah, I know. There's some that like track your. Uh, you know, like there, there's like oh, the Bluetooth goofy one. Bluetooth, they're like uh, Fitbits for your balls. You know. Yeah, I feel like startup money got in it. And yeah, that's just, what it is. As soon as you got the jewel of sex toys, yeah, which just became, probably happened a while ago. Yeah, I think it was like the rabbit. Yeah, with the, with the rabbit. Yes, that came yeah, over yeah, yeah. Like, Connects with your iPhone, and you can yeah, track it's, your it's, masturbation it's, it's, stats. It's, like, it's too like we talked about that in our very first show. Did we? Yeah, yeah. Like the cock nerdy? ring that like oh measures, yeah I mean, that like tracks your sex. Oh, there was that. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We talked about that. Yeah. But we were more laughing at. It. I'm more coming from the place of like, it's not cool anymore. Like, uh, what the fuck did I say here? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I said a sex toy should feel wrong. Uh, I don't like there are like politics attached to it, and there's like some group that's like fighting for it to be okay. Like, I want shame. <laughs> yeah. yeah you know I'm yeah. saying like I want to buy the toy. I want to walk out of the place like looking down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, yeah. I don't want yeah. someone to hand me the clear bag and go, no. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You walk out of here and you be happy. Yeah. With what you have purchased Yeah, yeah. Today. That's why buying condoms is fun because it's like... <clears throat> yeah, you still feel... You still, it's like, you know... <clears throat> yeah. Everyone sees that. Yeah. They know you're fucking. And they're also like, you still use condoms, bro. Yeah. I mean, little do they know, they're for jerking off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Much easier because then you don't have to clean the lube off yeah, your you dick just, after. Yeah, you just... just and it's like a little personal trash bag. Exactly. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You know, they make trash bags for our trash. Oh, don't do it, man. Crazy. But you know what else they make it for? What? It's like a trash bag for pleasure. Okay. It's called a condom. Mm. You know what I mean? I, 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 don't, I don't want... I don't like that if I just type vibrator on Twitter, there's going to be like a 10,000 retweet. It's like, RT this if you use a vibrator and you're <laughs> proud of it. It's like, no. Yeah, it's got to be secret. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Let that shit be taboo. Because yeah. it's more fun that way. Yeah. That's why people like fucking in public and stuff because yeah. it's taboo. Yeah, it should feel wrong. Yeah, don't fucking. No, oh, this is my sex swing room. Yeah, well, that's not fun now. You know what we need is like is like flashlight energy. Yeah, flashlight. Like we need energy. like it to be. You know, if they're gonna be if dildos are gonna be all over Twitter, we got to bring flashlights out <laughs> yeah, and just, out and about. Yeah, hey fellas, don't be ashamed about your flashlight. <laughs> Show it off. Just dress like, it up. Just leave it out. Take selfies with it. Yeah. Yeah. With the <clears throat> pussy part facing the camera. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Kissing it. <laughs> oh, no. Me and Henrietta oh, about to get down. No. Henrietta? Yeah. I just had to pick the weirdest name. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. All right, I'll be honest. Like I got a, a flashlight named Henrietta. All right, I'm, 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 let me come clean about that. Henrietta. That's the most unisex name I've ever heard. Henrietta. I know, right? <laughs> Is that a guy? Is it a girl? <laughs> It could be could in between. Be, yeah, could Who knows? Be yeah, um, yeah. So we we uh, we got a big show run. Potent. We're yeah. We're hoping we land a big run of shows. Yeah, we had the call today. It was initial next year. Initial call early next year. Early next year. So not that far away. Yeah, we're gonna set up to do a nationwide nationwide tour. World premiere. <laughs> nationwide is. On your ass. It's ass eating season, baby. <laughs> Tom Brady only buys nationwide. Nationwide between your thighs. <laughs> <laughs> like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. <laughs> hey, what's going on? Oh, uh, Tom's going to eat my ass again. <laughs> oh, geez. Oh, this actually sounds like a real ad read on like a radio. It thing. does, yeah. Oh, geez. Speaking of ads, no ads for the past two episodes. Yeah. But we did have that one. We did get one. We did get one. Did and get hopefully one. more in the future, but yeah. none for these two. So no. you're welcome. Yeah. If you missed that first ad, go back and you know what? Just go buy a watch. com slash tiny week. Fuck it. <laughs> oh, free, free read right there. We're not even getting paid for that shit. No, no. Vincero.com slash tiny meat. V-I-N-C-E-R-O dot com slash tiny meat. Get, get, the, get the Get watch. you a watch that gives you that big dick energy. Yes. Oh, they're going to exactly. hate. They're going to hate that we're doing this. They didn't pay for this. That's so fine. Oh, we can say what we want. <laughs> what the fuck we want, dude. Oh, this is fucking corporate bullying <laughs> right here. Oh, this is getting the upper hand. You know what I'm saying? Oh no, we're gonna advertise your product the way we want to advertise it. Yo, <laughs> for son, free. <laughs> yeah, for free. Yo, son, if you got a fuck, if you got that big dick energy, that fucking <laughs> guck guck energy, that fucking cervix incinerating energy. All right, let's okay. chill. Let's no? chill because we do want them to buy more okay, ads. Right, right, right. All right, take yourself to patreoncom gang. 
You support Tiny Meat Gang because we all about it. You know what I'm saying? Good. Yeah. That was a good, good that, cover. That, that big, big energy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. BDE. That BDE. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> you gotta Triple be, smidge energy. You got to be careful with with those letters. Oh, watch like dudes with big dicks start saying like on BD and stuff. What, what is that? Is that a gang? Black Disciples? Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah huge gang. Yeah, yeah. I, from <laughs> Chicago? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna make I'm gonna make you smile, baby. On BD, on what? Oh no, no, big big dick, big dick, big. I'm sorry that that one just rolled off the just rolled off the tongue. Sorry, rolled off the tongue there. Sorry, got a little carried away on BD. On you big see dick. you see Juice World leading the fuck six nine chant at a show. No, yeah, at like wow. a London show apparently. Wow, yeah. Yo, six nine was like all bragging on Instagram. He's like, I would like a bus boy and shit right now. I'm doing shows like 50, 60k show. I'm like, son. That's not a lot for that a rapper. That is a lot. That for a rapper? Is, yes, dude. That's a you shit think? ton. Yes. Standard is like, <clears throat> Tory Lanez must be making 30K per show. I bet you. No. Yes. Game is picking up like, dude. Game. No, no. Like, that's, but that's, that's weird. Like he, for some reason, makes a lot of money. He shouldn't be making that much money. <laughs> he shouldn't be. Like he's not that popular. Like just yeah. think about it. Like yeah. in terms no, no, of ticket no. sales. No, I know. There's what? 5,000 people at the show probably? Less maybe, than? Maybe, you know. It's a theater? Maybe it's because like game, maybe it's because game, like came from the era of like 50 and stuff. Yeah. So like brand wise, it's like, he's a bigger name. Like I think, well, he's got a shit ton of fans like in California alone. Like yeah. that just love his shit and yeah. go to every single one of his shows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he's got a pretty niche fan base. Yeah. But like, I mean the people that are like touring right now, like they're playing, you know, they're, they're playing like the shit, uh, like the f- Fonda and shit like that. Right. How many, yeah. see, how many seats is that? I don't know. 2000. Yeah. Something Not big. like less than Yeah. what they're paying $20 a ticket. Yeah. 20 grand maybe 20 grand like after you pay out tour manager and everything like yeah 20 grand per show probably something like that they're only making I more of their take if they're playing i mean the only step up from that is theaters yeah but like i saw the shows that six nine was playing he's not playing that no he's not but he's like he's it's going still like, a fuck ton per show though it, it, it is but it just felt <laughs> i don't know i guess to me rappers get like 100k for a show but i think i'm thinking of like uzi vert and like yeah. the biggest rappers yeah so I guess, yeah. I yeah. mean, dude, like Uzi Vert played that shit that I was at in New York, the Point mm-hmm. Sky party. Yeah. There was like 30 people there. Yeah. They probably paid him 20 grand. Yeah. And he did, still did the show. Yeah. Which means he's probably not making 100 grand per show. Yeah, Because if true. he was, right. he wouldn't do a show that's You're right. You're right. All right. So I'm, I'm hating. <clears throat> I think people in general make a lot less money than you think. Yeah. Like even people like like Dobrik, I feel like. Yeah. In my mind, he's making million ninja too. In my mind, that dude's making millions of well, dollars n- per day. Oh, I mean, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, ninjas. Talk making, about his streaming numbers. This is pretty interesting. Yo, yeah, this is actually fucking not to like pivot into weird shit. This is actually no, no, no. This is interesting. This is pretty fucking crazy, actually. So stream talk, <clears throat> stream talk. All right, so uh, let me do a little bit of setup here. Uh, let me let me give just a big fat shout out to my boy uh, Siva, aka Chili Pan. This dude, um, been friends for a while. And so he knows that, like, I'm quick to, like, get down on myself, right? See, like, I, when I start something new, I can get discouraged pretty easy. So he knows that about me. He's the one who got me into streaming, kind of. And so I kind of started talking shit about myself. He goes, bro, listen to this. So he was like, Ninja became a Twitch partner in 2011. I mean, he's been streaming. Wait, wait, wait. Describe Twitch partner yeah, yeah, yeah. and what so, a sub yeah. is and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you don't know, Twitch is like, <clears throat> um, there's a system for subscriptions and stuff. And if you just wait, 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 one second before you keep going, I want to, I want to preemptively say this. This is the reason why I've said in the past that Twitch is made for or designed to make money. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This shit's crazy. Yeah. So if you just sign up to cr- like, if you create an account to stream on Twitch, um, I believe the, uh, you, you, all you can do is stream and you have to hit, in, you have to hit certain goals to enable, uh, the donate button. And then from there, people can send you PayPal donations, but that's it. Mm -hmm. And then once you become an affiliate, you can receive subs and people can subscribe. Oh no, yeah, yeah, you can, I think you can get flat PayPal donations, but they can't sub, that's what it is. And when you become an affiliate, people can subscribe to your channel and they can pay monthly certain amounts, five, 10 or 25 bucks. Like Patreon. Like Patreon. And they can either pay it themselves or Twitch is a deal with Amazon Prime where anyone with Prime can subscribe to one person for free. And you get... And Amazon Prime pays them. Yeah, Amazon Prime pays them. So then I think when you get partner, I think that opens up like longer subscriptions, I believe. Like so someone can commit to subscribe to your channel for like nine months and they can kind of... And pay up front? 
And pay. I think so. It's okay. like they guarantee they're going to support you for a certain period. Plus, on top of that, you have. I mean, you, you can imagine if you're donations if you're streaming for six hours and you have a decent amount of people watching companies will pay like you can read ads yeah it's like a six hour podcast you can read 50 ads you're you can customize all the panels on your page so that enough people go to your page it's like the youtube description but like richer with images and shit you can just make that all ads too and i mean i don't know if we talked about this on here but i i get why twitch works in the sense that like it's like youtube on steroids it like that cycle of like putting out content connecting to people talking them i mean it happens all in real time yeah so I see why people get really popular and build <coughs> followings really quickly because it's like, yeah, totally. And yeah. if you have, if you don't have money, you can watch ads. <clears throat> yeah, which will give you this virtual currency, which you can give to the person, and they can exchange for money. Genius. So it's fucking like so many methods mm-hmm. of making money. And I think Twitch is working on enabling crypto as well. Like it just keeps getting crazier. Dude. Yeah, yeah, they've got it. They've got it figured out. You can, you know, on your stream in the chat have reminders that people to for people to subscribe. In the video, you can have like, yeah. you know, rich reminders of people to mm-hmm. subscribe or donate or whatever. You have like game mechanics. So you can like on your stream, you can say like last person who donated, last person who subscribed. Yeah. This is mostly for the people that don't know about streaming. Like I didn't know, you know, a month and a half, two months ago. But Me neither actually. I thought, I mean, like this shit is just, it's fascinating yeah. to me. And and this is the reason why I think Ninja makes fucking millions of dollars every day. Yep. But we found out like, or yeah, you, were, so, you were looking at a subject. Yeah, so because I, I start like, you know. I'll get like subscription amounts and I, I like feel insecure. I'm like, man, maybe I'm not like as entertaining as I think I am, or I'm not as successful. And uh, my boy Siva goes, no bro. He goes, look at this. So Ninja joined Twitch in 2011 and that's when he became a Twitch partner. So that's eight, seven fucking years ago. Last year in March, his sub variation was a couple on some days he'd get like 200 other days he'd get fucking three three subs yeah you know and and that's like lower than uh days that i've put in you know Uh it's like so see was trying to paint the picture for me that like hey dude it's like yeah and twitch is kind of like astronomical it's like or there's like a a, you know astronomical not astronomical it's like um like you think of it in like powers it's like exponential exponential yeah Yeah, yeah. i'm fucking sorry i'm whatever i'm brain dead right now um basically saying like what's big to you on YouTube, you got to cut that down to like a 10th of that number or even smaller. Like that's kind of how you measure it on Twitch. He's like small gains on Twitch would be like large gains on YouTube, Mm. which is weird to think about, but how much, so how much does a person take home for one sub? Um, I I think the split is half and it's five bucks. So it's five, 10 and 25. Okay. And then how many is Ninja getting per day now? So yeah, so oh yeah, so per day now yeah. he does between five to nine thousand subs every day. Every day, so he adds that many new subs, new subs to her his current ones. Cur- yeah, so so a conservative estimate I was telling you at like five thousand subs at the lowest tier, that's twelve k a day. Twelve thousand dollars a day, a day in that con- he's adding to in- his monthly rev, like yeah. basically monthly re- recurring yes. revenue. Yes, yes, every ten days he's adding on a quarter million dollars worth of value. Repeated value, repeated though. That's the value. thing. It's not just one time. No. It's, yeah, it's repeated value. This kid is worth like... I mean, there are giant companies that don't make that much money. No, and that's why you're saying, like, oh, this kid's going to be worth $10 million. I'm like, he is, like, right now. Like, right now, this kid is worth so much money. He just... He did a partnership with Red Bull. He, I saw that. They must have paid him, like, fucking yeah. $30 million. He just has a case of that shit sitting behind him. Insane. He has a hundred... On average, I see, like, a hundred to 130,000 concurrent viewers on, like, a Monday at, like, 10 in the morning. That's fucking crazy, dude. He's got like a Super Bowl commercial worth of viewership all day. No, no, no. That's I mean, no, no, no. That's that's what that's a it's like a fraction of that. But what would that be like? Hundred thousand viewers? Yeah, yeah. That's insane. I mean, that's like I don't know. Like, like I think like the hot the hottest shows right now have ratings of like a million views per week. Sure, something like that. Okay, so he's like what? He's like the tenth of a. Yeah, it's insane. All the time, all day. Like a tenth of the Bachelorette audience. Yeah. There you go. I sometimes wonder if like going into the real world is like weird for him. Like a lot of times if I play video games for like four or five hours, I don't know, Fortnite especially, or maybe it's just because PC games, I'm really close to the screen or whatever. And then I log off like, oh yeah, real yeah. world is weird. I'm like, oh yeah, people are moving at different speeds, you know, <laughs> I get, you just like, get used to it. Yeah. Or like a spatial anxiety. I get that yeah, sometimes. Yeah. I wonder yeah. if he gets that. Like, cause he plays for six, eight hours a day, a session. And then he'll take a break and play again. Yeah. He and d- it's like 
he did it, the other day he had a stream he's like 12 hour stream minimum i was like yo because he probably missed a few go days. to sleep he, well i mean he's probably just you know making it up to his audience yeah. but like yeah it's funny because like you know i see him play sometimes and i'm like oh, he's not doing much he's just kind of playing but then i think about it i'm like he's probably six hours in like mm-hmm. i'm probably just and it's crazy to think that a viewer jumps in halfway and they got what is their expectation for you for it to be entertaining right yeah and like that's pretty wild streaming is fucking crazy man. it is it's a whole nother beast i didn't understand it before that's why i kept dissing it now yeah. i understand it so i still diss it but still, still diss it, yeah. it's like it's it's stressful man i like mm-hmm. don't enjoy it i get it i think i'll get there eventually but it's just like for i right now it's like i didn't have fun with it until recently because learning Fortnite in front of people fucking yeah. it sucks yeah dude. yeah yeah, and, and I think I'll get random people who like don't know why like I have viewers and mm-hmm. people like will go and be like, you fucking blow, dude. And I'm like, oh shit, they don't get it. Yeah, you just came here from the Twitch Discover page. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, it's a, uh, I don't know. I'm liking it. I actually like it too much. I'm having to cut myself off. Yeah. No, that's probably good. I mean, yeah. I don't know. Find something you enjoy and if you're making money, you're, it's good, you know? Yeah. I th- cause, um, Cause my plan I think with YouTube is like, I'm gonna keep it a little experimental. Mm-hmm. I just want, I kinda wanna do more artistic shit. I think that's why like I'm not having fun with YouTube as well. Yeah. I've bitched about it for too long and like, I kinda wanna go back to like making sketches and stuff. Yeah. Like, not so like highly produced. Yeah. No, but, let's do it, man. I would yeah. fucking love to go back to sketches. Yeah. I wanna act again. Yeah, same. You know, like I thought that was fun for us to like, you know, shoot something decent quality and we're like, we're getting a script yeah. and you get a little something to chew on, Yeah, you know? And I, and I think we can do that. Like with like the bit we did, uh, with the coma, you, me and Kyle, <laughs> yeah, that yeah, was yeah. fun. Yeah. It was only like an hour, yeah. but we just shot it real quick. Yeah. I'm like, oh, yeah, we should go back to that shit. Yeah. Even like the brochler. Yeah. That, that was shit way, was funny. Yeah. And that was way fun to make. Yeah. So I'm like, all right, yeah. keep it lean. Oh, we're going to try one on Friday. No, conference and you got to make sure to keep doing steamy tweets yeah yeah no no i'm not gonna let up on yeah, that that's yeah, like my yeah. dream come true yeah like of a, a like a irony account yeah so uh it's, if any uh if any riblet wants to make the twitter profile picture make it something sexy i don't care what it is it could be a stock image of abs <laughs> just give me something <laughs> yeah, just do that yeah do a stock image yeah. of ads that's funny yeah okay make it dre drexler's ads from the video oh my just god just cut that shit out and make that the oh icon. my god there you go <laughs> or just make it him yeah just like with his hands up in or his hair or that yeah <laughs> i'm gonna hit him up i'm gonna see if he'd be down if i just put steamy tweets i want to read can i read the ones that you have hell yeah bro <laughs> all right so these are the ones that are on the account now so we or he made this account after we did the second steamy tweets <laughs> video which how many how much views how many views does that video have? dog that's almost at seven hundred thousand views Jesus fuck that's hitting a milli for sure yeah first one's almost at a mil all right steamy at steamy ass tweets twenty three thousand followers already <laughs> <laughs> most recent tweet guys who come hard eyes emoji corn emoji and then like the emoji <laughs> when she rides it and moans darn <laughs> I have to thank Sam for the inspiration on that one because Sam wasn't really like clued into the joke and then Cody explained it to him and we're all playing Fortnite and then Sam just goes into his mic oh darn 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 <laughs> oh crud oh crud oh crap um, y'all won't have sex on her period but you put ketchup on fries <laughs> <laughs> I love it when we rise and grind <laughs> so good oh let me shout out my boy who came up with that one um our boy Nick Kirk at Nick Kirk twenty two. He goes, yeah, he sent me that. I, I got something for you guys to post. I love it when we rise and grind. <laughs> oh, that's so good. There's a, a lot of people on here, and uh, I want to like read these in the next video. <laughs> this is a profile picture. So <laughs> that's so <laughs> good. <laughs> Just, <laughs> what did you think of the scream on the recent I thought one? It was good. Yeah, this one's way better. Yeah, though. I mean, there's no way I'll be able to there's beat that no first one. That one. That one was just too good, you know. And and um, I kind of had fun like editing that uh when when the camera died because mm-hmm. the audio was so genuine. I'm yeah. like, I don't want to lose that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah that so, was like, good. Using the stock I like that. I like that. that was a great idea. Yeah, thanks, dude. It's funny what you can do with just audio. Yeah, <laughs> that's still being that perfect. (laughs) (laughs) 
Oh, dude. The that first time I watched scream. that, it hurt. It <laughs> fucking, fucking hurt. Scream. Oh, man. <clears throat> I feel like I'm coming out of my shell a little bit in front of the camera. Yeah. I could, like, I, even on the first one, I watched it, and I'm, like, so low energy. Because, you know, when we made that, I was, like, nervous. What? This steamy first steamy tweets? tweets? I was, really? I was straight up nervous. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I get, you're just nervous. Like, as soon as you know an idea, like, has legs... That's when it becomes easy because that's when yeah. you really roll with it. Yeah. But as soon as you're a little bit self-conscious about like the video idea or something yeah. because they don't all turn out good. No. No. Yeah. And I think that's the thing I struggle with is like on on stage, I have no problem getting up and saying something crazy because mm-hmm. I know I'm going to get the feedback immediately. Yeah. That's all the way the thing I struggle with. I like, you know, people have said that shit like, oh, like you're you're funny everywhere but your own channel. Like like when I sit down and talk and it's like I get it to a degree because like I, it's weird I don't know I turn on the camera and if I'm sitting by myself I'm like hey what's up guys I'm yeah like, but yet streaming how is streaming any different because the, the people are there yeah yeah they're so watching. Like I can like you know yeah. I can gauge it yeah no I feel you I definitely feel you so whatever. I definitely I feel definitely you. feel you man definitely feel you dude oh yeah bro yeah oh yeah mate yeah bro oh yeah mate oh yeah feel you mate. <laughs> I'm Australian now, mate. Wait, so there's this new Fortnite skin coming out that looks like a fucking... Enough Fortnite talk. No, wait, wait. It's got like a fucking... Like a detective skin. And I'm all the way do the fucking... Eh. <laughs> oh, a bit of a canceled stamp, I see. <laughs> oh, my. That's a choice bit of Wonder calico right have, there. Yeah, <laughs> Matthew McConaughey skin. That's what I need. Yeah. <laughs> so you can just be creepy online. Yeah, yeah. Creepy Overwatch oh. guy number two. They seem to have picked up an SMG. You know what that means. Uh, back where I'm from, slurp my gonads. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you uh, slurp my gonads? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> oh, could you uh, say my name? Mason. Go ahead and say Mason. Oh, yeah. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh, Mason. Holy crap. Holy crap. <laughs> I got to go, uh, as the laundryman says, take care of something. <laughs> what? The laundryman? Bruh. Creepy. Who is going to be the first gamer? <laughs> um, That's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> to get no Who actually be the first gamer it already happened I what? was gonna say to Dr. Go Disrespect like a gamer to get caught up in like some scandal like a real scandal yeah like, not like a goofy scandal okay you know uh, but man to that point I wanted like I was talking with fucking uh, Felix from Chapo Trap House mm-hmm. and I want to do like a parody documentary on like what I like to call n-word gamers okay alright these are guys that are like 20 we talked about these are these are kind of like the you know who who's gonna blaze it <laughs> we talked about this on the stream before but i want it or on the podcast but i want to do a pair like a mockumentary of these guys like washed up like the like remnants of like 2001 like bubba sparks fans okay <laughs> <laughs> you know what i'm saying like they get yeah. online and they think it's okay for them to like drop n bombs and shit yeah and like they genuinely believe that they're black and like like that one of the guys that's super good at Fortnite, one of like the best players right now. Who? Tifu, whatever his name is. I don't I don't know. Is you it, don't? No, no, no. I have to look him up. Dude, the way he speaks, man. A little like, bit. Dude, it's cr- it's so cringe. Yeah. It's so cringe. Oh, for sure. For he goes, sure. No, no, he goes, it's lit. Yeah. Oh, oh, damn. Dual wheel. It's lit. It's lit. Yeah, yeah. No, this is this is this is finna go off, dude. It's lit. Yeah, like it's just white kid from yeah wherever. But it's got to be like 2001 era. Yeah, like his favorite rappers are Bubba Sparks, Kid Rock, Eminem. He's Dr. more Dre. like new school. Yeah, he's, he's more, more new like school. yeah. He's the modern made version a few of beats that. and thinks yeah. he's yeah you know urban. Yeah, whatever. exactly. Yeah, nah, and like <clears throat> I need the guys who like live in like Montana. Uh-huh. They got cats. And they'd be like, ah, oh, damn, <laughs> that for sure, man. And they'd be uh, <laughs> okay, dropping yeah, that yeah, shit yeah, online. Yeah, You're yeah. like, yo, okay. what the fuck? You cannot say so that. So they still exist? Oh, they still exist. Oh, wow. Okay. The amount of I've encountered on Fortnite is like, it's too many. Really? There can't, yeah. You talk to random people on Fortnite? No, because like I used to like squad solo. Yeah. And there would be like people who would just play. And I would queue up with like a few of these guys. Uh-huh. And th- they were just like, you know. 
Like if they were good, I wouldn't mind like squatting up with them again. So I'm like, hey, you want to squat? Cool, and we'll play a few more games. And like through the course of the games, I get to know them, and it would always happen. It'd be like, oh man, you got ammo? Yeah, yeah, sure, I'll split for show, sure, man. Whoa, wait, what? Hold on. You're like wait, wait, whoa, wait, wait a second, whoa, whoa, dog. Whoa, whoa. Wait a second, dog. I'm not here to police the word, but it just sounds wrong coming from. So anyway, I want to do like a mockumentary of these guys and like fucking like Fubu and like Lot Twenty Nine. You should. That's funny. <laughs> fucking like a like a graffiti Bugs Bunny. Yeah. In like baggy jeans, and they're just like in their room <laughs> playing fucking like. <laughs> Fortnite. They're like, what, 35? 35. Like they got kids and shit. Yeah. They're listening to like, hi, my name is what? <laughs> like, what's up, my? What, what what we what are we doing today, bro? Kids in the back repeating the N-word. Yeah. No, don't say that. Hey, kid, knock it off. Connor? <laughs> Connor. Knock it off, Kason. Jesus. <laughs> my kid, dude, you know. <laughs> fucking tweaking over there, yeah? <laughs> I'm trying to think of like Tweaking. weird like '90s slang and shit. Like they're just not with it at all. <laughs> uh, yeah, I like a girl that gives you know front to back. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, homie? Like Exhibit says for sure. Yeah, it's like dude, download Spotify. Man. Yeah, there's please. a lot of shit out there. That dog, sit. Yo, this is a niche California thing. This in the city of Glendale. Sit there. And just, you can count in a day at minimum, three BMWs will pass you, and they're listening to How We Do by 50 Cent and Game. Okay. I fucking hate that song. Why? It's fucking this old. It's, 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 it's old. old. It's old. Stop it. It's old. Don't listen to it. Candy Shop. All that, like, <laughs> well, the, the beef for Candy Shop isn't bad. And specifically, How We Do is just like, oh, it just makes me cringe. Because it, it's just like the... Uh, man, there's something corny about that beat. Yeah, just, yeah. it didn't age well. It sounds dumb. Fucking corny. Yeah, this is how we do, and now I will just always associate it with Howie Mandel. Why? Because they used that. Didn't they use that song on like, or it was a joke or something on uh, on uh, yes, no, what was, what, no, no. What was this fucking game show? The New Deal, the Big Deal. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. How to, not how to yeah, deal. Let's make a deal. How to make a deal. How to become a drug dealer. Or yeah, whatever. yeah, yeah. How to deal one on one. Yeah, how to deal. Yeah, yeah. Dealing drugs. That it would have been awesome if one of those girls just opened up the thing was just full of coke. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wrong briefcase. Yeah, oh <laughs> shit. <laughs> what the fuck was the show called? Let's make a deal. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was let's make a deal. Yeah. No, it had a. Was it? Yeah, let's make a deal. Mm, no. says, no, Alex, I'll take Let's Make a Deal. <laughs> Alex, let's take shows Cody doesn't know because he's Canadian for 1,000. <laughs> what is the show with Howie Mandel no, featuring? Not Let's Make a Deal. Damn it. Um, Hold on. Deal or no deal. You deal or no deal. Idiot. Yeah, yeah. That's what you I yeah, that's what, That's what I said. That's what I said. You didn't say that shit. No, that's totally How to make it, or Let's Make a Deal was an older game show. See? That maybe this one was based on, but not the same <laughs> show. All right? <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, um, yeah, he had a joke on that show or something. This is how we do. Oh no! Or it was the theme song or some oh, shit. No. This is how we. So now I think of Howie Mandel. I don't think of that. Every at all. time I hear that song, you know, I saw him one time at a diner. Yeah. Howie Mandel, he walked in. Did he give you the diner in Santa Monica? Did you? Did you, did you get anything from him? Did I get anything like from in him in terms of like a handshake? No, it's more just like, whoa, check it out, Howie Mandel. Word. That's pretty cool. Let's what make a deal. What? Uh, I heard the exhaust from that car all the way up. In the back of my head, um, yeah, I'm just. I, I want someone to catch him off guard with the handshake. Oh, look is, at this! He's the germaphobe. Oh, oh, he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. you're right. That's what I meant. So oh, I want to put. I'm just like, hey, what's up, dude? <laughs> oh yeah, you just tap him on the arm. <laughs> or as he walks by, what's up? Oh shoot! Sorry, bro. What's up? Oh, <laughs> my bad, Howie. I know you don't like that shit. <laughs> My bad. I know how that's how you do. I know that's how you do. <laughs> <laughs> this is how. Peace, bro. We... you how he does, yeah. <laughs> I don't. March, March, thirteenth, twenty eighteen. An article: CNBC is reviving Howie Mandel game show <sighs> Deal or No Deal. Wow, wow, that's something that's, that nobody asked for. Yes, uh, that's so cool. Let's make a deal. <laughs> <laughs> I want to do a music video that's a game show. <gasps> Has anyone done that yet? Probably. Like, what are we talking? Just like I don't know. Rapping on the Price is Right. Mm -hmm. That would actually be dope. <laughs> With the same effects. No, yeah. R yeah, rapping on Jeopardy, but like in the 90s. Yeah. yeah. That would be dope. Just looking dirty. Yeah. Yeah. 
I like the song that he's playing. Yeah, no, sorry guys. Sorry if um the uh, the the Drake remix is coming through and giving Drake's new vibe. album tonight. Is that tonight? Yeah. Yeah. It's a double album. Like the the real tonight or the future tonight? Like Oh, 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 I see what you're saying. Yeah, oh, last week. week ago. Yeah, it was pretty good. Wow. Pretty good. I didn't like some of the songs on it, yeah. but uh, a lot of the songs were solid. Yeah. That's can't, pretty safe. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty safe, like pre album. Can't, can't believe you said those things. Oh, yeah, dude. That one thing. Wow. Fuck, dude. I was like, what? Bold. Woo. And he had that, yeah, you know, he had that one lyric that's going to be quoted by every single white girl for yeah. the next year yeah. at least yeah. you know what I'm talking about yeah that one about how like you know like yeah. love and purple hearts and yeah, whatever whatever the fuck yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. that was shit that she was litty dude dumb yeah. litty <laughs> yo isn't that funny like um <clears throat> like okay you know like that we we joke about like the epic win personality yeah Drake lyrics are suburban kids personalities mm-hmm like it, it's so funny to see. It's so funny to me to see those kids quoting that shit, and they're like doing math homework. Mm-hmm. I agree. <laughs> Going to the gym. Yeah. Views. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just a dumbbell rack. <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> views of what? <laughs> views of what? It's like, and and they're giving me purple hearts because they know we still at war. Whatever that lyric is. Yeah. Tweet. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, <laughs> he starts jacking off. No to romance his, in his, his life at all. Facebook. Because <laughs> she still has pictures of them in high school up there. <laughs> He's trying to remember what she's like. Oh man, remember when she used to? Man, tweeting purple hearts because you know we still at war. Love you, baby. <clears throat> Text me back. <laughs> I saw. Uh, this dude on Twitter, Chain Body, he quote tweeted this dude. He this dude was tweeting like some rush shit, and he goes, "It must be hard being a living red receipt." <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Wow! Ultra Holy flames! Holy shit! What Ultra a Ultra flames! That hurt me. Yeah, <laughs> get bodied, homie. Damn. Get bodied. Bar. <laughs> bars all the way bars holy shit, i read that man. i'm like oh this kid is delete it does all his control social media all delete <laughs> he says to delete iMessage from his off. phone control all, <laughs> control all delete your dick off yeah. homie end task <laughs> end task holy shit by the way guys merch should be out right now it is out right now it is out right now yeah we tmg official merch is out we got um uh, let, let's get a cut in here just so all right, in case it's not ready, TMG merch is almost out. Yeah. Um, it's going to be available at, what, fanjoy.com slash gang. I don't know what the URL is yet, but All right, we'll I'll, put it we'll right here. We'll put it here, here. yeah. <laughs> and check the video below. <laughs> yeah, so if you want to support the show and you like the Meek gang, the podcast, you want to rep the podcast, <laughs> yeah. and you want to you wanna whip into some fresh gear. <laughs> <laughs> you Maybe wanna- you want to... Whip into a cool shirt, yeah, or maybe perhaps, and say "nay nay" <laughs> to the, the bed. <laughs> well, why don't you whip on over to the clothing shop and nay nay your way into a brand new shirt? <laughs> <laughs> nay, why don't we shoot? Oh jeez! <laughs> oh jeez! We shoot your way into a new wardrobe. Uh, it's like a the congressman. Yeah. Trying to appeal to Gen X. Yeah. Fucking, or or the Denny's account. Yeah. Nah, Denny's account does all right. Yeah, so it should be out right now. So go uh, hit the URL in the description or whatever, buy a shirt or whatever. These these designs we worked on before, but now I want to do a yellow shirt that says stay safe. Yeah. I think that's fucking, that'd be fire. Yeah. I think yeah. it'd be super fire. Yeah, we knock one out. Yeah, I think it'd be dope. real quick. Yeah, let's do it. Do it. Uh, we got to go record. We're going to make a new song mm-hmm. right out. This new song will have been made. Yeah, yeah we made a new song it. already. Yeah. So yeah, um, it'll be out elsewhere. Um, this is a uh, this is our first feature, dog. We just let the people know this is our first feature. Yeah, that's true. I guess it is. We're featuring on the we're, track. We're featuring on the track. Damn, pressure's on. We yeah. gotta write hot verses. Yeah, yeah. I'm thinking something like, um, Yo, this uh. is how we do. This is how we men. Del A. Uh, that's All right, yeah, <laughs> that's the episode. Deal or no fucking deal. All right, here uh, it goes. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for listening. Thank you guys. We appreciate you. Yeah. Um, 
uh, new merch, patreon.com slash tiny meat gang. Bonus episodes up there. Bonus episode is up there and it dings, my friends. And uh, you're going to get another bonus episode this month. A little bonus. A little bonus. I can't talk. That's what happens when you talk for two and a half hours. <laughs> two and a half hours straight. What do you mean, dude? We just got here. Oh, yeah, right. No, we just got here. Right, right. I feel good. I feel fresh. I feel fresh. See you guys. All right. Thank you guys.